powerful new Teespring Google integration enables sellers to easily create ad campaigns on Google. This is a game-changing opportunity for sellers to get their products in front of millions of shoppers around the world. Teespring's integration with Google makes advertising simple. Sellers will get to enjoy benefits like hassle-free product feeds. You won't have to deal with constantly setting up and syncing feeds every time you create a new product. We'll automatically add your new products to the GMC product feed for you. Then Google will review the new products within three business days. You can also use your existing URLs, so you don't have to create custom domains in order to sell Teespring products through Google Shopping campaigns. You can also enjoy simplified account management. Normally, in order to use Google Shopping campaigns on other platforms, you'll need to create and maintain a Google Merchant Center account as well as a Google AdWords account and sync them. But with Teespring, we'll take care of all of this for you. All you have to do is set up your AdWords account once you receive the invite from us. Google Smart Shopping campaigns can help you get the best value from each ad by optimizing the ad placement and bidding for maximum conversion value. This is going to help you find the right shopper on the right channel at scale. As your ad campaigns get smarter, this can lead to lower cost per conversions and higher return on investment for sellers who invest in advertising. When we compare standard and smart shopping campaigns, we can see that both campaign types have their pros and cons. But it's clear that smart shopping can offer Teespring sellers some powerful advertising advantages. For example, smart shopping campaigns are triggered by descriptions and titles from the listings added to your product feed, while standard campaigns rely heavily on specific keyword optimization. Also, smart campaigns are extremely effective because they're fueled by machine learning and focus on intent-based advertising. This means showing products to people who are actively searching for them. This machine learning is fueled by data collected from Google products like Search, Gmail, YouTube, Maps, Chrome, Google Play, and Android, and have over 1 billion users. All of this data is used to ensure that your ads are showing to the right consumers at the right time and in the right context. It's also notable that smart shopping campaigns have been able to unlock 20% more conversion value for the same amount of ad spend. All in all, smart shopping campaigns can simplify campaign management, optimize your campaigns based on your goals, and extend your reach to shoppers throughout the Google network. This makes them a great advertising option for new sellers and also those who have experience with Google ads. So let's jump into how you can create your first smart shopping campaign. Once you're in your AdWords account, go to the campaign section and select the plus icon as shown in the image here. Then select new campaign. On the next screen, you should choose Shopping as the campaign type and click Continue. Make sure to select Sales as the goal of your campaign. Next, make sure that you've selected your Teespring Merchant Center account from the drop-down menu. Enter United States as the country where the products will be sold. We plan to add more product feeds for different countries and we'll update the community as soon as these are available. For the last part, make sure to select Smart Shopping Campaign as the campaign subtype. Then click Continue. Next, let's select the settings for our Smart Shopping campaign. When it comes to the campaign name, you can choose whatever you want. This name won't appear externally. As you gain more experience, you can look into customizing your campaigns by product type, for example. So in the future, this is probably how you're going to determine the name for your campaigns. I'll provide more information for you on this in the Training Center. But since we're just starting out and this is my first campaign, I plan to advertise all products. So for the name, I've put all products. For the budget, it's up to you to decide what you want to spend. Keep in mind the more money you spend, the faster your ads will ramp up and optimize. Also, you need to let this ad run for 14 days during the learning period. So make sure to choose an amount that you're comfortable with. I'm going to leave maximum conversion value in the bidding section as is. When you're first getting started, we do not recommend setting a target ROAS as this can actually limit your campaign's performance. But it's definitely a tool that you'll want to explore as you gain more experience. For the timeline, don't forget that your campaign should run for at least 14 days. All smart shopping campaigns require a 14-day learning period. As you gain more experience with Google Ads, this is where you'll be able to customize ads based on things like product type or category. But for now, since we're just starting off, I'm going to leave this section as is. So we know that Teespring sellers are accustomed to having to create ad images for other advertising platforms. But that's not the case with smart shopping campaigns. Keep in mind that your ads are going to pull your product images, prices, descriptions, etc. directly from the product feed. The assets that you see here will be used in a retargeting ad in the very, very rare chance that someone visits the site from your ad and does not indicate the product they're interested in. 
so you don't need to spend too much time on this. I've got some examples of assets here. I would recommend keeping everything generic. I'll link to the marketing image in the training center for you so you can just copy that image and use it here. As for the final URL, you'll just want to link to one of your stores or specific listing. And that's it. Once you click save, you'll be taken back to the dashboard where you can see your new ad. If you want to customize the metrics that are displayed in your dashboard, just click the columns icon. Before you begin analyzing your ads, there's a couple of things you need to keep in mind. First of all, smart shopping campaigns require a 14 day learning period before they begin to ramp up. You should try to avoid editing your campaign during this time. That being said, some sellers may notice ramp up early on. If this happens, you could consider scaling up your daily ad budget at that time. Keep in mind the longer your ads run, the more data they will collect and the smarter they will become. Over time, you'll want to see your conversion value increasing and your cost per conversion decreasing. You've heard me talk a lot about conversion value, but the most important metric for determining your ROI or ROAS, return on ad spend, is all conversion value over cost. Learn more about these metrics and the Teespring Google integration in the Teespring Training Center now. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you found it helpful.